Let's loop pictures continuously in PowerPoint 2013. This can be used for advertising. Imagine yourself being a, an owner of a, an Indian restaurant selling butter chicken and samosas. How do you actually loop through images um, and advertise your goods? So what we do is you go File New and then choose a blank presentation and uh, what we do is you find a picture off the internet you right click copy it and you click here and you right click paste it and you paste the butter chicken and you can resize it and you can see that because the default here is a wide presentation you might have to stretch it quite a bit we're gonna have to play for it with some more settings to get this image a bit uh, not so widescreen but that's for another tutorial you can right click create a new slide and that's how we create a slide. You can even click on the slide and press delete on the side here. So we created a new slide and we found another image off the internet and we also resized it until it filled up the screen. Now when you're trying to fill up the screen I recommend you go to view, zoom, and zoom down to 50%. It will be a lot easier to resize things. Alright, so what else do we need to do? We go to uh, the slideshow, setup slideshow. So within setup slideshow, the one option we need is loop continuously until escape. So therefore, your slideshow will loop forever until you press escape. The the idea of a looping slideshow is also useful for um, a uh, presentation of any sort. It doesn't have to be an advertisement. You can just uh, present you. Uh, whatever topic you're you're uh, trying to showcase as people are walking around from booth to booth. Okay, so we set up the loop continuously within the setup slideshow. If you jump over one, two tabs over, we have transitions. So within transitions, what we're going to do is we're going to choose after and then choose two seconds. So click on after, advanced slide after, one, two, two seconds. This is probably too fast but for the sake of uh, your time I'm just gonna make this very quick and then it's very important to apply to all so we, by clicking on this we basically made every single slide automatically advance either on a mouse click or after two seconds so now let's go to slideshow and click on from the beginning or press F5 to run it and you can see that we have a butter chicken slide here and we have a samosa slide here and it's cycling without me touching anything. So you now have the power to advance slides non-stop. Let's press escape once and create a rotating slideshow of um, rotating pictures. This is great.